day, guys. I had to get rid of my HRV wheels. Not even lying. I have no more HREs. Might as well throw this hat away. Nah, I'm just playing, guys. Welcome back to the channel. In today's video, as you already saw by the thumbnail, I might have gotten some of you guys. We are doing something with my HRE wheels today. Uh, we did get rid of them for this video, so so stay tuned. You guys will find out what I mean by got rid of my HRE wheels. But as you guys can see right there, this is no joke. I have no more HREs in this garage or on my F80, so no clickbait there. I did get rid of them temporarily for like a week or two, but just stay tuned, watch this video, and you'll find out why. But I wanna thank you guys for clicking on this video. Make sure you guys hit that like button, that subscribe button. HRE is here to stay on the channel, and I hope you guys enjoy this video. What's up, YouTube? We are in the car right now. We're actually on the way to Kyler's house, F30 skirt. Shout out to my boy, Kyler. He's actually letting me borrow his stock OEM wheels off of his F3340. If he didn't let me borrow the wheels, I would have to leave my car at the shop for like a week or a week and a half, however long it's gonna take. And I don't really wanna do that right now. So shout out to Kyler, cause <laughs> especially with like the new paint correction and ceramic coating. I don't wanna leave the car just sitting there baking in the sun when it could be just in my garage. I don't plan on driving the car at all. I plan on taking my fiance's car and carpooling with her. But just having the peace of mind of having the car in the garage, protecting that paint, of course. On the way now to his place, gonna swap over the wheels real quick. Can't believe I'm freaking doing this right now, but <laughs> fuck it, I'm going with my heart. I think you guys are gonna love it or hate it. I don't really care, it's my money, so. <laughs> but yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this one. It's a very spontaneous decision that I've been thinking about for a couple months now. I thought about waiting to do it next year, getting the wheels refinished again, or even copying like a cheaper set but honestly, I want to see these HREs refit. I mean, I think it's going to look so hard. So, fingers crossed everything works out. So, after I swap over Kyler's wheels, I'm going to be dropping off my HREs at Olympus Wheel Repair, which is where I got them refinished a couple months ago before BMW Invasion. They did an amazing job. They absolutely killed it. I honestly trust them the most. I already called the owner, gave him a heads up that, hey, I'm going to come drop off the wheels today. And so, hopefully, he can get it done within a week or like a week and a half top so <laughs> I can't wait to just go back to the all look. it's who I am it's what I wanted my BMW to look like when I was in high school so I love the polished lip look but it's time to go back to my roots yo <laughs> just pulled up to Kylie's house skirt <laughs> I think it's gonna look sick wrong. like everybody knows you know doesn't obviously photograph that well you can't really see it that well but it's we'll just make, we'll make it look good yeah know. we'll make it oh you know he'll he'll make it look good <laughs> got that 30 chilling over there shout out to kyler again for letting me borrow his stock wheels <laughs> they're gonna look ridiculous yeah. on the f80 i mean with your like stands, with the stands yeah i really don't know how they're gonna fit yeah, i'm hoping i'm hoping <laughs> <laughs> all right we are on the way home right now i actually ran out of time but we got the package. Package is secure. <laughs> I got Kyler stock 18s in the trunk and in the back seat, as you guys can see. I did try swapping over one side of the wheels, but I was running into a rubbing issue on my brake, actually. And in order to take my spacer off of my HREs, I needed a flathead, which I didn't bring. So it's probably better that I just do this in my garage anyway. That way I have plenty of time and I'm not rushed and I make sure I torque everything down correctly. But yeah, I'm pretty much gonna be putting on Kyler's wheels and then the car is literally gonna be sitting in the garage until the wheels are done. Again, I just wanted something that wasn't jack sands or I didn't wanna leave the car outside at the shop uh, for too long. But I'll catch up with you guys back in the garage. All right, so we are back in the garage right now. We got Kyler's wheels lined up over here and then I'm about to jack the car up and test fit them for you guys. I think I'm gonna put some spacers on the front and the back just to make sure I clear the brake right there. Kona, what do you think about the new wheel setup? <laughs> Yo, this looks crazy. Freaking 18s with how low the car is. They're not perfectly flush right now. That's why it looks like it's super cambered <laughs> and it's obviously not on the floor yet. I just wanted to test the wheels and make sure that they're not hitting the brake caliber. Up front, it's super close, but in the rear, there is, I think, a decent amount of room. But again, I'm not driving anywhere on this setup. I just want it to just sit in the garage how it is now. I was telling Kyler I might just leave the fronts off and then just have a jack and jack stands on both sides. So I think that'll work for the time being, but but this looks funny as hell. <laughs> looks like a completely different car. <laughs> Conan, what do you think? I don't know. I don't think she likes it. <laughs> But yeah, this is how the car is going to look for a couple weeks, a week or two, until I get my wheels back. Again, huge shout out to F30 Skirt, Kyler, for letting me borrow these wheels so my car could sit in the garage until the wheels are done. Can't wait to show you guys the finished product. Let me show you guys one last time, I guess. 
what my current finish looks like. Sorry, my wheels are super dirty right now, but we have a polished lip and then a clear raw face. So it's basically like the raw aluminum and then you clear coat it over top of it. Freaking love this setup, don't get me wrong, but I wanted to wait another year or so to get them refinished or find a cheaper setup wheels maybe like some apexes or something hre even has like a flow form series that are pretty affordable if you can find them used but this rod is actually cheaper and i trust my wheel people so i can't wait <laughs> and i want to see these s101s in the finish that i have in mind so let's go aston what do you think <laughs> all right we finally got the hres off the car i didn't put kyler's fronts on because of what i told you guys earlier it was a little too close for this big Brembo right here, so I didn't want to risk it, of course. So what I have is the car jacked up with a jack stand on both sides. So that's how the front is going to stay until the wheels are officially done. And then on the rear, I have his 255, <laughs> which cleared the brake. So that's just sitting on the floor. And then the same goes for the other side. But here we go, guys. Last look at my HREs in this finish, at least. <laughs> They're not going anywhere. Trust me. They are a little dirty right now. I'll probably wash them before I drop them off at the shop tomorrow morning. Obviously, I don't want to give them a dirty wheel. But yeah, this is it. I'm going to miss the polished lip gang, that's for sure. But going back to my roots, getting rid of the HREs. <laughs> that's going to be the, the title and the thumbnail. Getting rid of my HREs or can't afford my HREs anymore. <laughs> Aston, what do you think? Wheels or these wheels? Honestly, if you guys aren't a fan of wheels, that's your own personal preference. Again, it's my money, my car, my build, my decision, and this is what we're choosing to do. So yeah, the car is going to sit exactly like this, probably for a week or two, I would estimate, and hopefully they can get it done quicker than that. Uh, but I will keep you guys updated, of course. Don't worry about content, though. In the meantime, I do have a couple other videos planned to pass the time. Obviously not with my car, but with other builds in Orlando. So stay tuned for that. But I will catch up with you guys in the morning when I'm on the way to Olympics to drop off the HREs. I'm actually going to load them in my fiance's car now. And then, yeah, I'll catch up with you guys in the morning. All right, it is the next morning. We are headed to Olympics right now. Took off the HRE logos last night. Obviously, they, they don't need them. And then I could just put them on when I pick the wheels up. It'll be the finishing touch. <laughs> Can't wait. Got my tire pump for my fiance's car. Not mine. But this is the last look of the F80 that you guys will see for a while. I might update you guys in the next video. But here we go. We are out. We actually have all the wheels loaded in the Kia Forte, as you guys can see. And then I got two more in the trunk. But hell yeah, let's get it. All right, we are in the car right now. I don't know if I have told you guys what finish i'm going with yet for those of you guys that know me you know exactly what finish we're going with <laughs> so take a good last look at the current finish which is again the polished slip and the raw clear face for those of you guys that are new here i'm not going to reveal the finish just yet and if i did in this video already i'll probably bleep it out just to build up some suspense and hype for those of you guys that don't know don't know me and my style take a good last look at the hres <laughs> i actually wanted to load them up in the kia last night but my fiance's car is uh, not tinted, so I didn't want, what, $10,000 wheels just chilling <laughs> in the car uh, for anybody to just come by and probably break a window and steal them. Obviously, that's my mind just, you know, <laughs> over-exaggerating things a little bit, but hey, anything could happen, you know? So I put them back in the garage and then took the center caps off. So yeah, I'm super stoked. I'll catch up with you guys when we get to Olympics. Also, really quickly, here's my new Uniden R3 radar. This is actually a re-gift <laughs> to myself and my fiance. Uh, we bought it for her mom for Christmas, but all the beeping around town while she's driving kind of drove her nuts. So she gifted it back to us or let us borrow it for now. So I'll probably be ordering a blend mount and a hardwire kit pretty soon. So stay tuned for that video. Pulling up to Olympics wheel repair right now. I'm gonna talk to the owner, ask him a couple questions, and then uh, roll these wheels out. All right, we just dropped the HREs off at Olympics. This is their shop. Just talked to the owner, super cool guy. Uh, he said it's probably gonna be another week, or like week and a half. Olympics rim repair. There you go. You guys are in the Orlando area, definitely hit them up. Amazing, amazing work. I can't wait to see the finished product. All right. That is the last we're gonna see those HREs for a while. When we pick them up, it's gonna be <laughs> it's gonna be a complete night and day difference. So night and day difference, if you know what I mean. 
But yeah, I'm uh, go home now and then I'll catch up with you guys in the garage. HREs going in for some surgery. Let's go. That's gonna wrap it up for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. It was definitely a spontaneous move on my part. I did not think I was gonna get the wheels refinished this soon or this year. Um, but hey, you gotta go with your heart and go with what you feel. So I'm feeling this change of pace at this time and at this moment. So I can't wait to show you guys. Can't wait to reveal it. Most of you guys know me, <laughs> know my style by now. And you guys already know what color and finish I'm going with. But for those of you guys that don't know and have no clue, you guys are just going to have to stay tuned and wait for the next couple of videos. It should be soon. I should be picking up the wheels, hopefully by the end of next week, if not early the week after that. It's actually going to be super dope because I'm going back to like the old me, I guess you would say. <laughs> the OG BMW guy that half of you guys know me for. So stay tuned. That is coming soon. But as I mentioned before, we do have videos planned for next week. You guys don't want to miss out. Make sure you guys drop a like. Comment down below what finish or color you think I'm going with. <laughs> It'll be fun to read everybody's guesses if you don't know. So comment down below what you think. And we'll see you in the next video. Take care. Peace.